Hello everyone, this is Satin here and I welcome you to Power Push to Power BI skill series of Power BI visualization. In today's video, I'm going to talk about two exciting features of Power BI service. Yes, you heard it right. Power BI service, not the Power BI desktop application. Right? Before I go ahead and talk about Power BI service, subscribe my channel if you have not done already in order to get exciting updates from Power BI as well as Tableau visualization related videos. Now, I'll just move ahead to Power BI web service which you can access using app.powerbi.com. Over here, I have already logged in into my workspace and you can see different data sets content or workbook related to my workspace over here. Now the two exciting features which I want to talk about or elaborate about Power BI web service are getting quick insights related to your data set and the NLP integration, basically how you can utilize NLP into your charts, right? Using NLP, you can ask Power BI to create charts for you. Yes, Power BI will create charts for you if you provide a right command. So let's get started. I'll just go ahead and select a particular data set here. Right click and we'll say get quick insights. As soon as I do that, Power BI itself starts, you know, analyzing that data set and comes up with some suggestions. Now, as I clicked on view quick insight, you can see Power BI has given several charts over here. First one is like pie chart. If you scroll down, you get some other charts related to the same data set. Sales, profit, sales and row ID, row ID and quantity, row ID, postal code by state, profit by region, profit by subcategory, post and post sales and postal code, row ID. Guys, it has given number of quick insights or suggestions right here on a single click. You might have taken, you know, hours in order to create these visualizations, but Power BI web service is quick enough to provide these quick insights on a single click. Now, not only that, you can go ahead and utilize these visualization and pin these visuals into your dashboards. So for example, I don't have in dashboard, I can just create a new dashboard. We'll say pin. This particular visualization will be added into that particular dashboard. I'll go ahead and scroll below and maybe I would like to add this scatter plot to the same dashboard. I'll say pin and to new dashboard existing dashboard and new dashboard pin this visual also maybe i would like to scroll further and yes postal code by state but yes profit by region is what shows the exciting number to me i will add this visual also into the dashboard and finally i'll go ahead and maybe add one more visualization for example sales by city and I'll pin this into my existing dashboard. We'll go ahead and see the dashboard that how it looks like now because I've added a couple of visualizations into my dashboard. So I just clicked on that and then I'll go to my workspace once again and over here you can see new dashboard. We'll try to open this. So now you can see all those visuals are already part of my dashboard and the dashboard is ready within two to three minutes. It not even take more than that. So this is the beauty of quick insights like Power BI web service offers you those quick insights related to your data set, which is already hosted on web service and it can create visualizations for you on a single click. The another important feature which I wanted to talk about was related to NLP. I'll go back again to my workspace and then you can see a particular data set 
I will click on create report and over here I'll just go ahead and select ask questions. As soon as we add that ask question, this is the control which appears on your screen. I'll maximize it and you can write your question here. For example, top 10 product by profit. I'm writing my simple English over here and Power BI service has created a visualization for me. Not only this, if you want, it will create a pie chart for you. So pie chart for region and sales. Here we go. It just created a pie chart for you with the regions and the sales associated with those. It is showing percentage. It is showing the level with the actual sales figure in thousands. These are the cool features provided by Power BI Web Service, which can fasten your you know, development process from data to visualization in a very less effort. So guys, explore more options like this on Power BI Web Service. I'll keep posting similar videos as we go. Please like and provide suggestions and comments on this particular video. Meanwhile, I create another video. Stay safe. Have a nice day.